What's up everyone, Speedex here and today I have my Utopia Hero deck to share with you guys, so yeah, let's get started. For the monsters we played 3 Kallenberg and 3 Star Drawing. This is pretty standard for any Utopia deck. Uh, you just normal summon him and you get special summon Star Drawing and you exceed, some, you exceed these two to special summon uh, Utopia and then you get to draw one from star drawing that's pretty easy so yeah then we play three shadow mist and one bubble man for our hero engine for the deck uh, this brings out dark law and this brings out acid then we play uh, performance engine which is three hat tricker and two trick clown uh, hat trigger is pretty easy to summon you just need two or two, two monsters on the field uh, it includes your opponent's side of the field too so it's pretty easy for him to be summoned and then performance trick on is pretty easy easy to bring him back to life also whenever he sends the graveyard you can pay a thousand and he, he you can bring him back then we play two summoner monk uh, he's semi limited for a reason because he's just that good He's an easy Dark Claw play or an easy Utopia play. And then we play two Sardanoxes for our Gemini Surf Knight play so that we can get an additional normal summon. So yeah, that's it for the monsters. Now for the spells, we play three XYZ Chain Tactics. Uh, this is a pretty key card in the deck. Uh, you just pay 500 life points whenever you XC summon a Utopia monster and then you could draw one card. So yeah, it's an easy turbo for the deck. Then we play three mass change for our Dark Claw or Master Acid. And then we play one mass change too so that we can bring out Master DN. Um, yeah, pretty good. Uh, and then we play three Brilliant Fusion for uh, Seraph Knight play. And because we want to see this card a lot, so that's why we play three. And we play two A Hero Lives. Pretty, uh, pretty good card. Brings out Dark Claw pretty fast, so yeah, that's pretty good. And then we play two Kaiser Colosseum because uh, Utopia Lightning plus this is pretty funny because then your opponent can't really play Yu Gi Oh! So yeah, pretty troll card. And then we play two MSTs to get rid of opponent's back row. Thinking about switching this to. to Two in test stage because I really don't like playing back row opponents. It's pretty annoying, so yeah. Uh, then we play one dark hole, one instant fusion, and one reinforces army. That's it for the spells. Now for the only traps of the deck, we play only two two traps, uh, time space, and bottomless for uh, Reflesia targets. So yeah, that's it for the main deck. Now for the extra deck. We play two uh, Utopia Lightnings, two Utopia, uh, one Utopia Ray, and one Utopia Prime. This is pretty good. Uh, we're always like usually behind our opponents because we're paying a lot of life points, but then we can easily OTK them back because we like special summon a lot of monsters with this deck. So yeah, and then we play one Dagoost Emerald to recycle our cards. Pretty good. Uh, then Castell to shuffle uh, opponent's cards. Pretty standard like in any deck really, so yeah. Then one Reflesia, since uh, she's our only like defensive option. Uh, she's pretty good. Uh, her plus Dark Claw is really good because they can't really play Yu-Gi-Oh, they can't special summon, they can't add cards to their hand. Well, they could add cards to their hand, they just, they just lose a card from doing so. so yeah pretty good um then we play one master acid to get rid of opponent's back row one master hero dn two dark laws and one norden and uh one seraph knight for our uh, double summon plays so yeah that's it for the deck i uh, hope you guys all enjoyed leave a like if you if you did and uh, peace.